chance only as far as Dak. It's rather hit him. Oh, and Akin Fenwa has hit it brilliantly. Ali Akin Fenwa, his first goal since August. And that may explain the extravagant celebrations. The big man with a big goal. And Gillingham, who haven't won in four games, have taken the lead at Prenton Park. Oh, McDonald, he's got away again here. And McDonald is bearing down on goal. And Jim McNulty could be in real trouble here. It's a straight red card for denying a goal scoring opportunity. Cody McDonald was wrong side. There was no one covering McNulty with the slightest of contacts, but it was enough and he can't really argue. Deep cross looking for Akin Fenwa. Oh, it's against the post, but Akin Fenwa gets it on the rebound. He has two, Gillingham have two. And I think there's going to be another repeat of a few dance moves here. And they've got every reason to celebrate Gillingham. They haven't had much cause for celebration lately without a winning four. But it looks as though that run's going to come to an end here on Merseyside. Thanks to the persistence of Adi Akinfenwa. It's always going to be a difficult task. And McNulty was sent off, but here it could be a real chance to get one back. It must be for low. It is. And they've got the best part of 15 minutes to try and salvage something from a game which looked well gone. Fantastic play from Ryan Lowe. He wouldn't be denied there around Stuart Nelson. And Tranmere have a goal back. But is it too little, too late? 